Evening. I thought for a change I'd just uh, sit and chat about a flight I recently had. Um, nothing special. Um, I had the grand intentions uh, of going to do some tuning because I had some oscillations in the mid throttle area. The pre filter gyro traces uh, in the black box log look pretty clean. There's a little bit of wobble. Um, but I mean, because uh, everything's locked down and pretty tight on, on the quad, uh, there's no bits flapping around and so forth, um, it, it must be down to the pits. Um, but of course, uh, one of the biggest problems I have with tuning is actually getting around to doing it. Um, I powered up and uh, then I just forgot what I was doing and, and started flying. So in an attempt to kind of save the, the session, what I thought I'd do is I'd, I'd try to uh, work on some of the bad habits that I've got when I'm playing. Uh, I do tend to bias towards uh, a right hand turn, so most of my uh, videos look as if I'm just flying around in circles, which is kind of really boring. Uh, so what I'm trying to do on, on this, this flight is, is uh, try to, to mix it up, go left to right, take the, the turn that I wouldn't normally take. So rather than going right uh, around the tree, I kind of go left and try and go through a gap. And if I can keep doing that uh, for a few sessions, then I think I'll kind of break those really bad habits of uh, you know, playing it safe. One more thing which I also need to work on is uh, throttle control uh, and height. Um, it, it's all very easy flying above the trees and so forth, but getting right down low, that's where the exciting stuff is. That's where the trees are, that's where the gaps are, uh, and it kind of looks a lot cooler when you're flying lower. So I'm trying to fly uh, lower. It's difficult, um, and of course, you know, the old fear of the ground is, uh, is ever present. They cleared tons of scrub from around these trees recently. Perhaps I'll muster up the courage to shoot some of those gaps later. There, a bit of wobble. Not sure that was from the sticks, uh, but you know, I, I don't care right now. Now, I'd have struggled to take those two gaps a few months ago. Perhaps next time, a little lower. Those RDQs were a lot happier this evening compared to that snowy day. Huge difference. I guess if the quad had real problems, then I'd be tuning it. But you know, it, it flies okay. And you know, as, as the saying goes, don't let perfection get in the way of progress. So I think what I'm gonna do, I'm, I'm just gonna fly. It flies fine. I'm not going to obsess, I'm not going to spend all my life tinkering and obsessing. I don't think my skills are really good enough to be able to tell a fine tune 
to one that kind of just flies fairly well. So uh, I think I'm, yeah, I'm just going to leave it now. It flies. And of course, uh, <laughs> yes, uh, this gap was just a little bit too tight. Maybe a ghost branch. Mm, yeah, boom. The two props gone. Never mind. Hello. Anyway, thanks for watching. That's all for this session. I might do a few more of these kind of things if it proves popular. Take care. Stay safe. Enjoy flying. So I had the good intention of trying to do some... <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Come lie down. All right, okay. I'll include you in the video.